Hello ladies and gentlemen, I am back with another video and today's video is about showing how to fix the PRNDL L or any electrical problems on the cluster. So here I'm showing you the resistors and the camera doesn't want to focus. So these look good obviously. On the arrow you can see it's broken. So I first began by looking closely at each resistor and making sure they're all correct. The way I did it was I heated up each end of the resistors and then added the solder or the joint, whatever you call it. And don't guys mind my beard, it's growing, whatever. And I hope this is this is my first time doing a voiceover in a video and I hope it goes well. And I just want to give you guys a little update on how the truck's going. So after seeing the frame on the front engine and taking everything out, I see that's a little rusty and I'm thinking of doing maybe a frame swap. I'll take the engine out and the cab. I already got a crane and everything. But first I want to decide if I want to put headers on and hear it or if I want to just take it out and then find go to like a junkyard. This process took me around 45 minutes. I had to stop to make sure it was all right. I had to look around, go to, I had to see every resistor and I had to put my head all the way in because I didn't have glasses. But when you do this, just take your time, and, you know, Alright guys, welcome back. Welcome, welcome back. is there. Look. So I, what I'm doing is I'm trying to take this all out. How am I supposed to take this out? How? This is a bolt. This is a 10 millimeter. So what I'm trying to do is take this out so I can move the computer so I could add access to the power steering thingy. I took out the belt right there. No, that's a belt. I took out a hose. Why didn't you focus in? I took out a hose. This is how it's going. This is the process. So let me get... I bought a new toy also. I bought the crane. So, so when I get the... When I lift the bed, these are the wheels. These are the ones that weren't sanded down. Alright guys. So, moment of truth. I connected the battery. I don't know if there's power in it. But let me... Am I... So we gotta put the key in. We gotta put the key in to drop the, the gear section. Put your brake on. Oh, I really don't want to turn it on. So that means there is power. So I'm gonna put this here. Connect the thingy. I'm just connect from the bottom. That was way easier. Oh, hell yeah, hell yeah, look, this is bright, I'm, I'm happy, I'm happy, so let's see if all the, if everything works, should I turn it on? 